Hi there, Tracy Tigers. I have a new exercise this week for you. It's called a squat. You're not going to sit in the chair, but you're going to use a chair to do this exercise. I'm going to show you in my office chair, which has wheels, so I'm not going to, I got them propped, so hopefully it won't move away from me, but I don't expect to touch it that hard to make it move. So watch me do a few. This is another new exercise you can do for a minute or as many as you can do in one time. Uh, it's a great workout for your legs, also for your, your heart as always. So let me move my phone into position and show you a couple chair squats that you can do at home while you're while we're going through this. So I'm just going to stand right next to the chair and I'm going to go down, touch my bottom and stand back up. Touch and stand right back up. Touch and stand up. I'm not going to sit on it. I'm just touching it and sitting back up with straight knees after I'm done. So I, my feet are about a, short, a little wider or as wide as my shoulders, maybe a little wider, but I just touch and I don't use my arms to push back up. I'm only using my legs, but I stand straight up and I'm trying to keep my legs straight and my back straight. There's our new workout exercise for this week. Enjoy it. I hope the step up last week was good. And I hope everybody's staying safe. Wearing a mask if you're going outside. Washing your hands for at least 20 seconds each time that you come back in. Or each time that you handle anything from the floor, the ground, or something that you don't know where it's been. Because we don't want to catch that virus in any way. So clean hands as often as you can. And then also try to keep them away from your face and eyes, mouth, and nose. Until next week, have a good Tracy Tiger week, and I'll see you then. Bye now.